Yo, 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 my Star Citizens and new gamers. Welcome back to another episode of Star Citizen with me, Menix. And in today's episode, I'm going to be doing some cargo running on 3.20. So this is my first time playing 3.20 in the live servers, which is now dropped. So I'm going to do some cargo running. Unfortunately, they took away my Caterpillar in the update, but not my Prospector. So I'm going to have to go and rebuy my Caterpillar, which is 4.6 million. So what not better way to show you guys how I earn my money and you can see through my eyes how I earn my money when I'm trying to earn it rather than me just doing an instruction video or whatever uh, you can actually see me and that and my decisions so we hope you like this video guys if you do like this video don't forget to take that point to tickle that like button for us don't forget to hit the bell and subscribe notification for more videos as we drop them and don't forget to check out the description for the discord link and the org link as well as the join the youtube membership if you want to help the channel out further so let's get into this one guys so what I need to do is earn 4.6 million to get my caterpillar back and I'm going to take out the Taurus the Taurus is 100 174 cargo so what I'm going to do is I'm going to head down and try and earn some get some gold and try and try and earn a million if I can in in a couple of hours so let's get into this one and uh, see if we can get this million done constellation Taurus and I've just basically put my paint on it in that. So I'll hang it in. So what I'm going to do is just see how we get on. See what buttons I need to change. I know there's some changes to buttons and that. So let's do this. Hang it in. So at the moment, the biggest ship I've got cargos for cargo is this one. I do have a railing, which is a little bit more cargo on this uh, than this, but obviously it's not in game at the moment. So let's do this. I do like this ship. I do like this ship. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to try and maybe go and get some gold. I'm over at the Microtech area, I like starting here. So I might get some gold, so I'll try and get some gold. Turn ship on. Starting pre-flight protocols. All systems operational. Veto. Affirmative. Request takeoff. Requesting clearance. Stand by. Retract landing gear. Retracting landing gear. So I've got to get myself out of Armistice Zone. For some reason, it doesn't let me put on my cruise control when I'm in an Armistice Zone. I'm not too sure why. Maybe it's a bug. I know they've changed the cruise control on the keyboard, but it hasn't changed on my pad. There we are. Now we can put it on. Right, so let's uh, figure out where we're going, guys. Let's see if we can get some gold, see what it's like. If we can't get gold, we're going to go for some vice. So we're looking for 18. Da, da. There's a lot of data centers on here. I see 18 is there, uh, around here somewhere. I've got to get the right, the right one for it. There we are. Set it right to that. Let's do it. I do like the new, the new um, QT thing. So 
I got about 400k on me to get money. So I've got to get to, I think, around 4.6k, uh, 4.6 million. I'm not going to obviously do that today, but this is the road to it. Get my caterpillar back. I did want to get the pirate caterpillar, but it won't let me um, swap ships for it. I, I have to get it with credits. But unfortunately, some of the ships I've got, I traded up from ships I got for free. So I can't exchange them for credits. Deploy landing gear. Deploying landing gear. Reset power. Power is normalized. Eric Steiner in his time when again. Tax me, but fine. If not, we'll leave him to it. Tried attacking me, didn't he? Windy today. Struggling a little bit with this. Turn engines off. Engines off. He just ran straight into the side of the mountain. Uh, boom. So you take care of a pirate. Let's right, see what we can get here, guys. So there is some changes in planned for cargo running and cargo itself, not just cargo running, but cargo itself in the way the inventory is built up and stuff like that, where you're going to have your own hangar and your own hangar terminal where you can control your inventory. It's going to be a, a good a good thing due to come. Can't wait. And that way, then they'll be able to add more stock because they'll be able to put timers as well on. Right, so look what we got. So we've got gold, ATSCU, and we'll take that for sure. We can only take 74. And we're going to buy it for three, uh, four, three, eight, seven. That's it, so we can get maybe some aluminium. Let's do it. Four, three, eight, seven. 
Let me quickly write that down so I've got it written down. A bit dirty, that one, isn't it? Tell you what I have got. I've got a, probably about 10 or 15 helmets that I looted from places like this. And they're worth about three grand each. So I've probably got over 30 grand worth of helmets that I can sell. If I put them on my ship and sell them over at one of the places. Like one of the space stations. If I sell them at somewhere like new Babbage, I'll only get 1.5 or 1.7 from, but if I, send, if I sell them up at the space station, I'll get another 1,000 from. If I pick one up, I'll show you what I mean, which one. And what I do is, when I come to these places like this, if I do loot, I leave it all in my in the local for a bit, and then when it, if I'm busy, and I'm not going to be going back to base, and then when I come back, later on it um either pick it up or it will just transfer it straight over to my place my when when i spawn but i think all that like i said is changing soon so now if you look at that one there if you press shift and click it'll just move it straight over to your wherever you've got selected here Always take some drinks just in case. There we are, put that off my thing. I'm not gonna loot. If you struggle to get on the things on this thing here, just go to this side here and for some reason he just walks on it. Maybe because there's like a little lip or something. I don't know. But he seems to just walk on it that way. Look what we got. There we are. Seems to be floating. It's the floor glass or something. Is that shine or something on the floor? That's cool. Makes it look like it's floating. <laughs> you see the big crates now. Bigger crates now. Can't jump on them though. 32 ones and single ones. Right, let's do this, guys. Let's go and sell this. So basically, all I'm going to be doing today is just basically cargo running in this ship, and you get to you get to see how I do my cargo running, what I come across when I'm doing it. Turn engines on. Starting bridge line overhauls. All systems operational. Veto. Affirmative. Track landing gear. Retract landing gear. Retracting landing gear. So when I'm in the armistice zone, I can't turn on my. 
I can't turn on my cruise control when I'm in the harnesses so for some reason. Let me know in the comments, guys, any of you guys having that same issue. Beat on. Affirmative. Beat on. Thing is, is, it makes it harder not being able to do that because sometimes I'll be heading up like this and I need to get to 11,000, so I'll stick on my cruise control but and then go to my map, but I can't do that like this. Vito. Affirmative. I want to be on flat ground because I've got a lift. I want to be on flat ground so that it doesn't throw me off. It means I've got longer to go, but at least I'm safe. Turn engines off. Powering down systems. Quiet. Normally, this place is full of ships. So I'm hoping, like, when you get your hangar thing, it's something like this, where you, it's like this little garage thing here. So you can get your ships there and then load up your ships from there and stuff like that. Something like that, basically. That'd be cool. So we spent 438.7, let's see what we sell for. We could only buy 80, which is only like a, yeah, a third or something of what we can do, just over, just under half. Gold. Am I going to sell it for five, five, three? Point eight. Except five, five, three point eight. So that was a hundred and fifteen thousand. Hundred and fifteen point one thousand we we made there.
So that's not bad profits, that. That was not bad profit for the for the constellation. 115 profit in that one go. That's decent for that one run. Now, when we go back there, I don't think there's going to be gold again. So we may have to grab some vice this time. I may do vice run this time. But then you guys can see how I make these decisions. The stock was... What did we? What was the 8 tier? We couldn't even get 8 tier, I don't think, could we? On the gold just then. We could only get like, dear something like that. So I'll show you here what I'm on about these helmets. So I've got these orange helmets here. I've got about 15 of them all scattered in here. And these will sell for around 2,700 each up at the spare stations. So yeah, I've got, I've got well, six there. Now, this is my first run of, the, of 3.20 in the live in the live verse. A lot of people will take their stuff and they'll, just go to, they'll head up to the space station, but I don't do that. What's that gun there? That gun sat there doing that. But I don't do that because it's just I've I, too many stories of people losing stuff. So I just leave it here, and if I want to come get some, I'll just come and get it. Yeah, it takes a little bit of time to come and get it, but at least I'm not carting it all around and worrying about that. I just head off and start my start my day as I want to. I don't even set a location up at the space station neither. Just gonna go and sell these helmets now. Um, I'm going to get 2.6k for each one. It used to be 2.7. At one point, it used to be 3. And it's, it doesn't tell you how many you've got. So when it doesn't tell, when you know you've got more than one stacked, if you just click quick sell, then you're only going to sell one and it will look like you're not selling it. But actually what you've got to do is, because they stacked, you've got to sell here. And then you can put max. And then it, you can sell them all. We're going to sell them all for 53,000. Oh, yeah. 53,000 we earned from that. Just buying me looting boxes every so often and just leaving them helmets hanging around. Let's have a look what they've got for rent. Close black, rent of time, freelancer. So I know some places they've got the, the scraper ones, the salvage vulture for rent or for, for, for buying in game so if you want to do if you want to do those missions you can now I'll show you them actually well here if you go to your contract manager and then in here you've got your salvage ones here we've got these new salvage ones here these clean up ones where you've got to clean up and you, st you pay 10 grand for this um no for this one you you get for free but you can earn 80 grand for it and that one you earn 250 grand but they do do a they do do um cutlass black which i'll wait for It looks like, uh, what's it called, is on. Jump town. So I'm going to go down and see if I can get gold again. If not, then I'll head over and get some vice. Because we made 115 grand from the gold, so 
or whatever, 100 and something grand from it. Yeah, I think 115. Remember, guys, the uh, ping has changed. You've got a hold V now on your keyboard. Anybody that's using pad, um, it's your normal ping button, but you have to hold it. And then when you let go, it pings. Which is good, because when I switch to missiles, I'm not pinging all the time, which is good. So it's a good, a good addition, actually. Turn engines off. Powering down systems. Right, see if the gold is refreshed. Eighty seven. We're not going to be able to get all that, but. Five hundred and ten. No oh, done. Down. Seventy one, four hundred and fifteen. So it's, it's, I'm buying it in chunks of sixteen here. Give that a second and see if it fills up a bit. So I've still got 100,000. The reflections seem so much better. Ah, it's 5 SCUS. That's why I'm struggling to get that last one. So let's just wait for that to top up, maybe. So we've got 86. And we can get another 20, I think. So let's just loot for a minute and then we'll come back and get the rest. Oh. Still some bugs that need reporting. The graphics do seem so much better. Although they have added the HDR as well. Oh, that doesn't. Looks a bit. Unless that's new. It's filthy. Some of the graphics are looking better anyway. Let's just say that. Keep an eye on because. That's new, that, the way that that looks. It's filthy. Maybe part of the new graphics. Shaders and that. Although I have only just started deleting my shader folders when I do a new install. So maybe it's, maybe it's all to you guys, but to me it's not. It's new. Right, let's go to the next one. I liked that. I did that then. When I can't pick it up, it goes red. That's much, much more intuitive, I think the word is. 
That's much better. Oh, it must be because the door was messed up earlier. Right, so I've got 81 now. So that is filling up quite fast, to be fair. 16. Confirm. Is actually complete? There we are. So we've got 102, and we spent all together around 60 odd. So 660,000 or something like that. Let's grab some aluminium while we're here. For four grand, see what we sell that for. Cool, let's do this, guys. See if there's any changes to the commodities price alert thing. Helium. Medical surprise. Nope. No changes. Right, so we started off with 603,000. So here we go, guys. We had 603,000. 603,000. Let's see what we can earn this time. So we made a grand on that. Seven hundred sixty-three. Let's have a look. Seven hundred sixty-three, seven hundred sixty-eight. We started off with six hundred and three, so we've made one hundred and sixty-five thousand on that run. One hundred sixty-five thousand. So I'm going to do one more run. Should be able to, by the time we get back, if the gold, because there's 800 gold there now, so it, it looks like it's stocking well. So I'm going to give it one more go at the gold and see if we can get it. This time we should earn another 25, 30k off that. So we should make about 200k on this run. So if we get a, a run in an hour, so basically I've been playing this for an hour now. And I went to the space station. So if we did say we earned 500,000 in that hour, that's a good run. That's what we'll be aiming at. See if we can do it. Well, <laughs> we've been running an hour already. That's not going to work. So we've made 200,000 in that hour. So let's see if we can make half a million in two hours. But obviously, I'm going to be cutting this video down, so. And what I'm showing you is basically, you guys can just see my everyday thinking, uh, running, just picking up the ship, biggest ship I've got at the moment, and just running with that. Taking a chance at gold. I've got a backup plan. If I can't get gold, I'll go and check out Vice. But saying that the what's it called is on at the moment jump town so i would definitely have a visit of jump of, of raven's roost and we'll, we'll check it out they may be spitting out bales but it depends where the the thing is at the moment and if people say well because Jump Town's on, maybe that's why you're getting some peace and quiet and it's not so busy and it's not full of pirates. Well, that's the time to do it then, isn't it? The time to do it is when it's like that and take advantage of that. Take advantage of those those things. Turn engines on. Starting pre-flight protocols. All systems operational. So we took 20 of the 80 odd last time, so there should have been 60 left, depending on how many people are taking this. I'm hoping we get again close to 100 and if, well, if we can get close to 100 again. See what we can get. Deploy landing gear. Already open. I thought you were going to say that.
Turn engines off. Powering down systems. Okay, let's see if we can get some more. Some more gold. If we can't get gold here, then I'll go and get some vice. Five gold. So let me buy forty five to begin with. So it's looking like when you go buy to buy it all, it won't let you if there's like half of unit like this. See this four SCUS uh, so and it's classing it as a unit, but it's not letting you buy a, a whole unit. So you, and it doesn't look like you can buy it in sections of one. That'll probably fail. So that's why it's doing that when you do a whole load. So we've got eighty four and we've spent. Probably about 500k, I think, up to yet. I think, what did we have? We got two, 270. I think we had 300. I think we had 760, if I remember. Yeah, we did about 768, I think, didn't we? So we got 207. So we spent about 500, or just, um, yeah, about 500. And again, we'll just wait around for it to stock up. Didn't take long last time. Let's go, go on loop, and then I'll be back in. Uh, still for a CSU. So let's just hold on a second. Eighty nine, I see you. Hundred and forty five, so we got hundred and twenty nine this time. We started off with seven hundred and sixty. So we should be looking at start off with seven hundred and sixty. I reckon we're gonna have eight, nine, twenty, nine, forty. I reckon. And we'll have 40 gold there as well. So uh, we could come back. So I reckon 940-ish to 950-ish maybe on this we'll, we'll have at the end.
So we are again, guys, at the Commons. Now, all I'm really doing is showing you here is how I start my cargo running when I'm doing it. And yes, it may be a little bit boring going back to the same place, getting the gold and back and forth and back and forth. But while it's available, take it while you can, because when when it's contested and there's loads of people going for it and you can't get your hands on it, then it's a different story. So always try it and then try have a, have a backup plan, like going for vice or going for beryl or something like that or diamonds. It so happens today we got lucky and we were able to use all the money we've got on gold and not have massive weights, not have massive weights around for it. To make a grand on that. 965. Confirm. So I said about 940 we would have. I, I was saying about 940, 950. We have 970. I think we made 200 grand there. Or just over 200 grand. Uh, I think we made over 200 grand there on that one. So I'm going to do another run. I want to make sure I've got that million. And then we'll call it. See what we've got. See if the gold is still there. Do one more run. So we've got 970. Now, guys, do not do what I'm doing. <laughs> do not do what I'm doing. If you're worried about losing your cargo, I mean, 30k is not really a massive issue anymore, so I'm not too worried about that. But if you're worried about losing your cargo to pirates and stuff, then don't do what I'm doing and, and buy all everything you've got onto gold. That's not a good. That's not a good thing to do, because if if you do get checked by pirates or you crash or something like that, you're gonna lose everything. So. Don't do as I do, do as I say, and only spend half. Unless you're happy to lose it all. If you're happy to risk it and lose it all, then then that's that's fine. I'm happy to risk it and lose it all. I've got other ships like the salvage ship where I can pick up missions and do salvage to start earning again. And so I'm not too worried about losing all the cargo. That's why I do it the way I do it, the way I spend all my money. But don't do that if you are worried about losing your cargo if you haven't got other ships to make money like cargo running ships although you can buy a what's it called now uh, a, a vulture to pick up the cargo missions so we're one and a half hours and we've made about half a million because I started off with about 440,000 and we're at now 970,000 so we've made over half a million in an hour and a half and if I can get another load of gold here we've been looking at another 200,000 maybe 220,000 turn engines on Starting brief flight overhauls. All systems operational. See, I can put my thing on like that, but the moment I start... That's better. If I put it on that, like, I can't be doing putting it on looking up. I've got to put it on looking forward. That's fine. Cool. See, while I was, because I was able then to put on my cruise control, I did it by looking, by going straight forward rather than looking up. But by doing that, I could then go into my map while I'm, while I was going up to, to the, to the point I could, I needed to. Let's 
do this. It's been a quiet one tonight, maybe because um, Jump Town is on. Or maybe because people are having issues with the game. I don't know. Seems fine for me at the moment. Don't want to jinx it though. Turn engines off. Powering down systems. Yes. See what we can get. Should be around eighty here. Yeah. Let's have a look. Seventy nine. I'm not seventy nine, but I'm gonna go seventy eight actually. 78 buy that and that the way we shouldn't get the error because we're not buying that one SCU that doesn't exist so we got 78 let's see where, what, where, what else we can get once we um, yeah another one of those helmets huh I think the 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 they're fixing the bug of the sound. You can hear there's not a lot of sound. I think they're fixing the bug of that. So we'll wait for that stock to come in. So I just looked a second ago at UEX and if I take it to the best place for buying gold, we'll only make seven grand more on a full load, so it's not worth it, the travel time. Whoa. So there we go. So the gold's jumped up to 179. It's a lot. We'll get as much as we can, which will be 85 for 502. Except that. So we're not full yet. We're, we're 11 away from full. But we've still got five grand, so let's grab some of that. And sell that as well. So there we are. So we've got 174. We spent 970 grand. And there's still 100 and odd left there. We could even do another run. Maybe. We'll see. Let's do it. So the sound that's missing, that's a bug in the game, guys. So we're going to be looking at, I was just checking out the boxes there. We're going to be looking at probably around, so we had 970, I reckon we're going to get 1170, uh, around 1170 I reckon. There's the final, 1 million 170. Turn engines on. Starting pre-flight protocols. All systems on bridge. There we go. One point two one million. One point two one million. One point two two million. So we've made altogether about eight hundred thousand. I'm going to do one more run because of that hundred nod that came in. I'm going to do one more one and see if I can get to that million. That'd be nice if I can get to that million in the two hours. Well, we're looking at around two hours at the moment. So this last one will tip us over the two hours, but. A million in two hours will be a good one. And what you've got to remember is, at the start, I started off with 400,000. So 
I didn't really have the money to fill up. I could only get around eight, around eighty. If that. So, as we've gone on, we've been able to fill up more and more. We've still not got enough to fill up. With with the one point two million, we still might not have enough. I'll have a look in a second when we're on our way. How much it is to fill up? Okay, let's get our um, SM18. This will probably be the last run. I'm hoping to hit the million. Nice, what I do. I think I'm going to get to that 4.6 million. So a couple, couple of days of this, and I'll be able to do it. And get my caterpillar back. Turn engines off. Powering down systems. Engines Hopefully we can get a good chunk here. There was 120-ish, I think, or 110, or something like that. And we let. So we'll see if somebody else is taking it as well. I presume there will be. I think 79 again, like last time. So we'll take that for sure. Take all of that. Buy. Confirm. Failed. 78. Bye. Confirm. Accept. So we've got 78 at the moment. And we won't be able to buy that one. So we'll just wait around for that again now. Right, so let's get the rest of this gold. Should be able to get around 90 odd now. Do it. 67. Buy it. Gold. Max. Buy. Okay, come off this and back on it. Seems to be an issue. 157. Taurus. There we are. 96. Everything. 96. Bye. Confirm. Except that's a whole lot. So a whole lot of gold. We've got 61 left. I'm not going to come back. This is going to be my last one. We've got a whole lot of gold. And we're going to go and sell this. See what we got. So this should tip us over the million. So let's do this, guys. Let's have a look at this a beautiful gold. Here it is. The big ones at the bottom. And twos at the top. And then there'll be a couple over the back here. Six or something here. There we are. So there we go, guys. Full Lord. Let's um, go and sell this stuff. And we're going to land this time because I want to put the ship away and that. I don't want to claim it later on because it's a long late claim time. But I'll push it forward for you guys. Okay, guys, here we are. Full load. Let's do this. No, we don't want the Pisces. I want the Taurus. 174. Boom. 1.3 million. Confirm. Accept. So I started off with 444,000 and I now have 1,497,000. If you that you struggle with that number, you can go to more trade and it shows it here. 1,497,000. So I've made 1,050,000-ish thousand. 
in a couple of hours. So that's that's really good. Uh, I, I did a good run there. Uh, I got lucky, I think, with the gold, but there was a couple of times where I had to wait for it. So, But also, I wasn't able to get full lords from the beginning. So even though I spent two hours doing it, I wasn't getting full lords at the beginning because I only had 400,000 and it cost a million to fill up the Taurus with gold. So, and you can get a profit of around 300, just over 300,000 on a full lot. So, um, yeah, there we go, guys. That's uh, me and how I make my million. When I, when I, when I want to do a quick one and get a million, just do a couple of hours stint and, and just use the Taurus, get, get a million. Go for commodities like gold or I'll try Beryl or I'll try Laranite, maybe some Vice, depending. There's a few different plans I have and that's one of them. And it worked out right for me there. So yeah, sometimes it's about luck, but we got it in the end and that, that's what that's what matters. It shows that you can do it. And so we hope you liked that video, guys. If you do like the video, don't forget to take that pointer for us. Tickle that like button. Don't forget to hit the bell and subscribe notification for more videos. Check out the description and for uh, the Discord link and to the organization, which is Noobs Gaming. And um, the code dropping down, that's a code we picked from random from one of our other videos. And if you want your code to show, if you subscribe, just leave a message in the comment section with your code and we'll drop it in there. We'll choose someone that will drop it in there. So yeah, we'll see you guys out in the verse, guys.